Let me tell a story about Thomas Thwaites. He tries to build a toaster in an unusual way. He doesn't buy any shit from a hardware store. Everything he uses is a refined raw resource. But first he buys a toaster and he breaks it down. So he'll know what materials he's got to get from the ground. And then it's time to smelt, filter, forge, and refine. Then he makes the first stop at an iron mine. He collects a few rocks, takes them back to his block. Pops them in his furnace and then he gets them hot. But the fuel source he used was totally out of whack. He tried to forge his final product and it just cracked. He finds a new way, smelts metal in a microwave from the ground up while keeping it real. Thomas Thwaites finally produces some steel. Now, the mica goes around the heating element, and there's a mine up north where the mineral is prevalent. So he boards a train to the closest station, cause the mine itself is in a remote location. When he makes the hike, he's getting nervous, cause he's got the GPS, but not any cell service. He's about to give up when the sun's getting low. But then he spots the mica, and he takes that stuff home. Now Thomas gotta build himself a plastic case, but the receptionist at BP is being a basket case. Thomas looks at options that are more obtainable potato based plastics more sustainable when you ends up doing is getting plastic scraps melts it down creates a new plastic batch and from this a toaster case is newly craft now copper is the next thing he's got to collect and he rolls up his sleeves cuz he's about to get wet he gets a scoop of water that is highly acidic and takes it home cause the copper be dissolved in it. He does electrolysis, no furnace, no fire to get the copper that he needs for his wire. Now let me tell ya. The man's in the pickle to be getting some nickel. When the sands of time trickle, he been stuck like a riddle. Cause the only open mines in a country whose symbol used to be in red and gold hammer and sickle. But he found another way, this time on eBay. Canadian nickel coins on sale, eh? He took up that offer and he sure done paid. So he can get that nickel, get his toaster made. Man's got materials, but he ain't trying to flaunt it. Steel, mica, plastic, copper, nickel, he got five on it. His toaster's a far cry from what he had in mind once he got all of his pieces combined. The project's not to make a working machine, but the project's a reflection of the materials industry. What makes the world go round in this industrial age are the products we buy and the way that they're made. Whenever we consume, it's never in our view. The things that Thomas has been trying to do is show us the steps of productions our products go through and observe how the earth can turn into something new.